You know, today I was telling somebody something profound. I have never told everyone for the, for my whole life. If I did, I forgot, but this is so powerful. Hello everyone, it's Ishmael. And by the way, Ian, I welcome you to today's video. I was like, you know, uh, the Lord, normally I get to see the power of being prophesied or for the Lord to come talk to you. Myself, I fortunately can say, Without a doubt, I have once had an encounter with the Holy Spirit. I was not sleeping and I was not <clears throat> really awake. I was in the middle. You know, when you are about to wake up, I was like in the middle there. I don't know whether I was wide awake or I was I was not really sleeping. Oh, just like our Paul. There I know of a man, whether in the flesh or in the... I do not really know. But to me, I was not really deeply sleeping. I was put there. And the Holy Spirit had a visit on me. And he told, I asked him questions on about my life. And as far as I remember, the things that, all the things that he said, eventually I saw them coming to pass as far as I remember. And because he assured. So I knew that that's when I began to see a change. That whenever I would pursue something, it would end up this way. Because, oh, I was like, yo, God did say that if I can do this, it will end up like this so that is when it became easy to me to understand that is why now i want to tell you that do not ignore if you are being prophesied if you god it promised you something and it, it does not manifest or it takes time or it seems like it will never ever happen refuse to accept such because that prophecy is a ticket for you to fight because the, at the end of the day, you are destined to get that thing. If God said you will get married, do not accept the failing when it comes to marital matters. You must fight, fight until it happens exactly as prophesied. If God said you're going to be well known in the entire world, it means it is bound to come to pass. But that does not mean the enemy won't fight it. And the enemy is fighting it so you give up on that vision. You give up on that prophecy. But if you give up, it won't happen. But if you fight, you are bound to happen. I, unlike when it is not been spoken. If it is not been spoken, it could not be the will of God. Meaning no matter how hard you try, such cannot happen. Hence, take advantage of a prophecy and fight harder until you see it manifest. I decree and I declare that it is so over your life right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. May you get it all. May you receive it all. Everything being spoken about you in Jesus mighty name I pray. Amen. And of course that's all I had. My details on the comment section below. See you next time.